Dope. Alright, so you already know, today is April 13, 2016. This is Kobe Bryant's last game. As you can see, we got the jersey. It's mine, by the it's way. It's actually hers. It's actually mine, you know. Had to. So, you know, we got the Bryant, you know what I'm saying? We got that 24, you know what I'm saying? Tierra, Tierra Tiller out here. <laughs> you know, working. What do you mean when I do? And welcome to the Tierra Thomas Show. I'm Dawson Thomas. Tierra Thomas reporting for 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 Let's just go. Let's 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 go. Let's go see the game. It's lit. So you know we out here watching the game. How do you feel that this is Kobe's last game? I'm completely depressed. I didn't go to class this morning. Are you serious? I'm dead serious. You didn't go to class? Okay. This just became a problem. Kobe got people not going to class. Like, tell me what's going through your body right now. What's your emotion? Watching this game, uh, watching Kobe play for the last time. Kobe was my childhood. So just like this, when like my childhood is trying to kill me, I was all dying at one time. Second shots, the last second mix, also the misses. Right. So repping Kobe out here, I got the kicks. Hey. You, know, you know, it's pretty emotional. I grew up, a lot of memories with this great guy, great athletes, giving me five rings. I mean, he has the rings, but really we share them, you know, we're all in one. <laughs> hey. And uh, I just got to say thank you, Mamba. How do you feel about Kobe's last game? <sighs> it's emotional, ain't it? <laughs> you know, like, I didn't expect him to leave so early. Like, I've been watching Kobe since, like, forever. Now he's leaving, you know, and it's kind of sad. You feel her pain? I do, I do. Like, Kobe, I feel like he was a brother to me. You, he's a brother and my brother. Oh, my to be honest, I've never been into basketball, but I have to respect Kobe as a player. He's my child. He's your child. Almost 20 years. Well, I grew up watching it. The reason I like, love basketball. It's pretty sad, How do you feel? How do you feel about Kobe's last game? Um, I'm really sad that it's Kobe's last game. You know, Kobe, that's my guy. You know, <laughs> not for I used to play basketball, and I really used to look up to him. So thank you, Kobe, for the all that you have done. We appreciate you. It's not over yet because the legacy still lives on. Yeah. How you look on the court, the finesse and it's just it's great for me. Kobe's attractive to you? A basketball attractive. Kobe's so bad. But you know, Kobe's that guy, he's gonna make it happen. Mom, but... Kobe is
Don't leave me, Kobe! No! That's a mess game. No! That's a mess game. Don't leave me, Kobe! No! That's a mess game. 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 No! Kobe for life. I've been a fan. I've been a fan. Let me get them. That look engaged in the game. I'm with you, bro. I love you, bro. Bro, you need to buy that my name is Gerald H. Timms. We out here watching Kobe Bryant last game. Kobe done made me cry. Kobe Bryant's the reason I play basketball, bro. I love you, Kobe. I love you, Kobe. Bro, I take that to you, bro. I'm sorry, bro. I'm sorry. I love me, Kobe Bryant. That's my dog, bro. And Kobe Bryant, number eight, number two, four, number six on his last game. We out here. We out here, Kobe. Hey, Kobe. <laughs> We just got finished watching Kobe's last game and just sitting there watching the recaps and the highlights. This man has mad talent. I did not follow him throughout my whole life, but just being here in LA and being in the atmosphere of all these Lakers fans, I have a lot of respect for this man and it was a good last game. No, it was a wonderful game. It was a wonderful game. A lot of emotion. Hey. <laughs> Sign up for TNT Creations. Uh, but nah, we need to respect the individual on the wheel. So like, I'm about to put this in there because she's being... Hi, my name is...